At least 14 people were killed and several injured when Maoist guerrillas in central India carried out two separate attacks. And poll officials were on election duty. Saturday was the fourth phase of polling in several states. CCTV Shwata Bajaj has this report. The first blast took place in a bar officials and the second had central police reserve personnel travelling in an ambulance. The soldiers were travelling in an ambulance to conceal their identity. Both the attacks took place within an hour of each other. The attacks took place in Naxal-infested Bijapur district and Dharba area of Chhattisgarh. Now many of who were critically injured were airlifted to a nearby town. The official said there has been a change in Naxal tactics. Earlier, the attacks happened before polls with the intention of disrupting elections, but this time round, it happened after polls. Reports suggest that forces were warned about a possible Naxal attack, but the bus, bus that was carrying polling and election officials did not have any security forces. Incidentally, after most Naxal attacks, the Naxals take weapons from dead CRPF officials, but this time, the weapons were very much intact. Now, Naxals have been doing frequent attacks over a decade now in India's Red Belt, where they campaign for areas uh, poor to have greater share of natural resources from the area. There are more than 12 constituencies that are Naxal infested that are spread over 12 states in these elections. Over 150,000 security personnel have been deployed in these areas, with 25,000 of the security forces specifically for the state of Chhattisgarh that saw the attack. Shweta Bajaj, CCTV, New Delhi.